transformation agenda in a manner consistent with its ambition by integrating innovation into every dimension of policy, program, and project delivery. The Kenya Innovation Week therefore reminds us of our increasing capacity to transform our economy. I remember making this statement last year. And that's why a year ago, I pledged to mobilize government to transform the Kenya Innovation Week into an international festival which attracts global participation. Subsequently, we placed a successful bid to host the Commonwealth edition under the theme of innovating to unblock our common wealth. I am immensely grateful to my sister, Patricia, of the Commonwealth for her considerable support and facilitation in organizing this event. And in you participating in person. We very sincerely appreciate this as a people and as a region. By definition, innovation is transformative. It radically enhances our capacity to solve problems and achieve goals. It empowers entrepreneurship and solidifies the promise of success in tackling climate change, in creating job opportunities, in enhancing efficiency, mobility, food security, education, and even expanding trade. Besides, we are now firmly in the age of artificial intelligence, machine learning, cloud computing, nanotechnology, and digital transformation in which capacity for innovation will continue to separate those destined for, for, for success from those who will struggle in futility to stay the same. We, are all, we, all, we all must choose our sides. And it is clear that all of us here, from what I see today, have cast our lot with innovation. <laughs> or maybe I'm, maybe I'm speaking too soon. Maybe there are people who are still stuck somewhere. Innovation has been identified in our national economic development blueprint as a cross-cutting element of our economic transformation. Consequently, the Kenya National Vision 2030 mandates our institutions of higher learning to increase the quantity, the quality, and relevance of their research output in order to produce such innovations and creations that will transform Kenya into a knowledge-based economy driven by technology. Our programs to establish and accelerate the commercialization of research has accordingly taken off with the establishment of the network of entrepreneurial institutions of learning providing a bold signal of our intent in this respect. This initiative shall also be accompanied by endeavors to enhancing inclusivity in innovation by facilitating access to quality infrastructure, financing, and training for youth in both urban and rural Kenya. As you're all aware, we are in the process of changing the law this week in Parliament so that the National Government Constituency Development Fund can now provide resources for the setting up of innovation and ICT hubs in every ward in Kenya. I have had a conversation with the chair of the ICT committee, uh, KJ here. We had a long conversation. In fact, we had a meeting where we undertook and we even designed how these um, ICT and innovation have to look in every world in Kenya. So when we say we are running with technology, we are not only digitizing government services, and we have 30,000 government services already digitized. By end of next month, 
we could possibly have every government service on a digital platform